Okay, Lou Depot back, and today you're going to learn exactly what that SEER number means on your air conditioning unit. The word SEER, S-E-E-R, always has a number after it, usually a 10, a 12, an 18, a 20, a 22. S-E-E-R stands for Seasonal Energy Efficiency Ratio, and that's exactly what it is. It's a ratio, and the ratio of the two numbers is BTUs put out per watt taken into the equipment. So, and I'll give you a perfect example. I have a 10 sear unit. And my neighbor just got a 20 sear, a brand new 20 sear unit. Okay, so for every watt of power I use, I get 10 BTUs. For every 10 watts of power, I get 100 BTUs toward cooling my room. 10 watts equals 100 BTUs. He gets, for 10 watts, he gets 200 BTUs. Now don't forget, 10 watts the same nickel, 10 watts. It both, both cost us exactly a nickel. I got 100 BTUs, he got 200 BTUs toward cooling the room. So you can see right off the bat, by having a higher sear number, he's getting twice the amount. So what's gonna happen? He's getting twice the amount of BTUs to cool the room. His equipment's gonna shut off a lot faster, and when the equipment's not running, that's when you get your efficiency, okay? 100 BTUs for 10 watts, 200 BTUs for 10 watts. If we keep going and going and going, you'll see the number gradually climb. So as you can see, the higher the SEER number, the lower the electric bill. The higher the SEER number, the lower the electric bill. And just the opposite happens too. The lower the SEER number, the higher the electric bill. So you want a very high SEER number. The equipment with the higher SEER numbers is more expensive, but long term you get your money back tenfold. So high SEER number, very low electric bill. It's BTUs produced per watt taken in. And as you can see, he's doing at least 100% better than me. Of course I'm going to change mine. 